We humans are special characters, right? Even though we live on Earth, our species is more curious about other planets as well. So friends, join with Theory of Science and let's go together and look at more things happening on the planet Jupiter. We have never seen Jupiter like this. It's all quite incredible, says planetary astronomer Imke de Peter. She said that it's incredible. What's that incredible thing that they've never seen before? Aren't you curious about it? Come on, go and subscribe to the Theory of Science to explore the universe more. Jupiter is a whole different beast compared to Earth. Do you know why? Jupiter is a giant planet in the solar system that could fit about 1,300 Earths inside of it. If Jupiter is taken as an elephant, Earth would be an ant. Its position is fifth from the sun. Even though Jupiter is a gas giant, the planet has liquid and gases surrounding it, moving in twisting, swirling patterns, and it doesn't have a true surface. It is almost impossible to land a spacecraft on Jupiter because the extreme pressures and temperatures deep inside the planet will smash, melt, or may vaporize the spacecraft like a plastic melting in fire. Speaking of composition, Jupiter is almost like the largest star in our solar system, the Sun. The main constituents of Jupiter are helium and hydrogen gas, and its atmosphere is also 90% hydrogen. On July 27, 2022, astronomers aimed at Jupiter with the James Webb Telescope's powerful infrared eyes. The images of Jupiter are captured through three different filters. The images obtained were really astonishing. The equatorial zone extends around the planet and looks bright white because of a high-altitude haze that reflects a lot of sunlight. The Great Red Spot, actually as the name says, is not a spot, but a famous storm so big it would swallow the Earth. As other clouds, this Great Red Spot also appears white in these views because they were reflecting a lot of sunlight. Then, the next thing viewed was Jupiter's auroras, which extend to high altitudes above both the northern and southern poles. We are all familiar with the aurora on Earth, aren't we? It is also known as the polar light. They are visible mainly every night near the Arctic and the Antarctic Circle. Aurora occurs when electrically charged particles get trapped in the magnetic field and spiral towards the poles. On the way to the poles, these particles strike atoms and molecules in the atmosphere, producing mesmerizing dancing lights. Don't you think another planet will also get aurora? Like having light in dark rooms with electricity and electric bulbs, another planet with an atmosphere and magnetic field, they may have aurora. Since Jupiter is the most giant planet in our solar system, it has the most powerful auroras in the solar system. It is one of the four massive planets with an aurora that can be found to emit X-rays, and the reason behind the energy generated to emit X-rays has been mysterious for the last 40 years. On other planets, normal particles present in the atmosphere take part in these processes, but in the case of Jupiter, there is a constant supply of other particles that are emitted into Jupiter's orbit. One of them is the Galilean volcanic moons of the planet named Io, which are extremely aggressive, vomiting out oxygen and sulfur from hundreds of volcanoes on the surface, causing a constant emission of X-rays. It has been found that there are more than 400 active volcanoes that emit lava continuously over Jupiter's orbit and become plasma, a soup of electrically charged particles, says James O'Donohue. Our phone gets charged when we plug it into a socket because electric current goes through it, right? This is what happens in both Jupiter and Earth. Electrons are accelerated along the magnetic field lines by electric currents. On Earth, the power source firing electrons, up to 30,000 volts, is the solar wind, whereas the standard voltage for households in India is 230 volts. Isn't too large beyond expectations. On Jupiter, the planet's superfast rotation, completing a day less than 10 hours, 22,000 miles per hour, acts as a gigantic electric generator, so electrons are expected to fire at a higher voltage than on Earth. Hey, don't get tense for Jupiter. It's just a planet with no presence of living things yet. We humans with very advanced technology are in great interest to know about our near planets that are trying to build five-star hotels there to spend the holidays. Aren't you interested in going for a trip in space? Before that, know more about the universe. Yo, go subscribe now for more information. Even though Jupiter was so far from the sun, its upper atmosphere has been so hot. For 50 years, scientists wondered why. This basic confusion is referred to as Jupiter's energy crisis. The reason behind this was Jupiter's most powerful aurora, which is the most powerful one even in the solar system, and this was responsible for heating the entire planet's upper atmosphere to surprisingly high temperatures. The auroral power delivered is 100 terawatts per hemisphere. Dunn says aurora on Jupiter is just like a pump, a burst of light, then wait 27 minutes, chill out, and then another burst of light. Wait 27 minutes, chill out, and then another burst of light. Knowing more and more about a planet's aurora helps scientists understand its magnetic field. Do you know the importance of magnetic fields? A planet's magnetic fields helps to know what the things happening in that magnetic field and the space around that planet. More precisely, for a life to sustain on a planet. Magnetic fields have a prominent role. As on Earth, magnetic fields are the ones that sustain liquid water on its surface, making it suitable for survival. 
Jupiter's magnetic field is 14 times stronger than Earth's. Jupiter has the strongest magnetic field in the solar system, so the compasses would work accurately on it. Dunn says, this whole new shade of light would reveal so many things that we just didn't even know about Jupiter. Let's unlock the world of infinite information around the universe. Do subscribe, like, share, and comment without thinking twice.